all brick ranch home for sale. Is it multi-generational? Hey, this is Roger with Prostead Realty. We're looking at a beautiful neighborhood called Sonata at Mint Hill. It's right off of 485. I'm going to zero in right here to exit 44. But I just want to show you in relationship to Charlotte, you know, Crestwind is right up here. If you've been looking around for 55 plus, well, hey, this is not 55 plus, but it definitely feels like 55 plus because these are all ranch homes, ranch and a half. So again, you can come right here and come right into Charlotte, you know, NFL, uh, NBA, uh, museums, etc. My wife and I went to the Beatles Fab Fest last weekend, uh, and we saw the uh, the Fab Four. Indeed, we did. Now let me let me zero in on this map and show you. Right off of Exit 44, that's 218 Fairview Road, you've got the Mint Hill Veterans Memorial Park. Now I'm going to have a video at the end of this one showing you that park. So stick around for that. Uh, this is a great park. And uh, I mean, it, it's, it's got a war memorial here, it's beautiful. Then you come right in here, you've got a couple of grocery stores. Over here you've got a Publix, a new one, uh, Harris Teeter. You've got Atrium uh, Health right here. You've got the very cool small town, I love it. Lots of restaurants like Shomar's uh, and uh, Jimmy's, one of the original restaurants here in the greater Charlotte area. Uh, Greek immigrants, very cool. CVS, everything that you need, and you're very close. So the proximity is fabulous. And uh, let me show you, if you may have driven in there and seen this sign. Now, it used to be called something else. They had a little identity crisis with a senior care center, so they changed the name a year or so ago. Now, this particular house uh, is located, I believe, right here. So you come in off the main drag. There are the models. You got a nice amenity right there. Got a pool coming, I believe. Am I right on that? I could look that up, call me about it, I'll, I'll double check it. You can walk right down this street and through this established neighborhood and get to that, uh, uh, the park. Or you could just a couple minute drive around. That's beautiful. I mean, for a walking, you could walk the neighborhood, but you could literally get up here and walk right down to the park. And they've got a lot of sports activities in that park. It's a free public park. So guys, here's the house. It's called the Astaire. Now, this house has a similar configuration. Wait till I get to the floor plan here in a minute, and let's talk about whether this could be multi-generational or not. The price right now, it's priced under 525, about halfway between 500 and 525. Prices could go up or down probably ain't going down. It's all brick in its construction. But I want you to notice this little extra third car garage. Ding, ding, ding. Do I have your attention? People. So what I want to do is show you how it could be multi-generational because they do build this similar plan with this as a multi-gen. They build it in that way with a door that goes right into a separate entry door that goes into uh, this one goes to the main house, but, but uh, the way this one's configured, this is stair, goes to the carriage garage or that's unheated living area. Uh, but uh, you, we could build it from scratch. I could have one of my agents, Rodney Jones, Denise O'Farrell, uh, any of my agents get you to sit down with the uh, on-site agent and design a house just very similar to this with this as a... Um, you know, as I was talking to Rodney about it yesterday, as a mother-in-law type suite. The only issue with that to me and why this could be better is that the space, when it's multi-generational, it's got the bathroom right over here. It's not big enough really uh, to put much of a kitchenette in it. But if you bought this one, I'm talking about this exact one, and the lot number is, I think it's 28, I could be wrong. Uh, but I want you to stay with me on this. Let's say you bought this house and mom or dad wanted to come and live with you. What if you took down this wall or you put a door here and said, this is going to be mom and dad's living room and, and we've got a door here. This is going to be mom and dad's kitchen, all right, with a closet maybe there. Uh, and then there's going to be their bedroom there. And maybe you put a door there. Well, what about this? Well, maybe that's mom and dad's craft room, living room. All of a sudden, you've just crafted a whole suite. Or with, without doing anything, maybe this is your woodworking shop. Keep it a garage. Let mom and dad have this as a living room and this as a kitchen slash, uh, you know, sitting room, right? Why not do that? Leave this as a garage. Make it a woodworking shop or a pottery barn, something. That'd be a good name for a shop, wouldn't it? Pottery barn. Wow. But then this could be your bath. This could be your kitchenette because you've got plumbing right there. 
and this could be your bedroom. So you've got two rooms and a full bedroom configured any way you want. And then you could leave this as a garage for your Porsche uh, or for Jack's car. Jack's got a convertible. Uh, and you've still got a separate entrance. You could put another door right here. So there are a lot of ways to configure it, guys. But this builder, Matt and me, we love them. Uh, you've got a gathering room in the back, the kitchen right there. You've got a flex room. You've got an uh, owner suite. Oh, can we say that? Uh, our our <laughs> MLS is going to start calling this the primary suite. Whatever. Uh, then you've got this veranda covered. And this has got privacy because you've got your house on this side, your house on this side. So you could go out there in your pajamas and have coffee. Guys, we love to be your buyer agent. We, we are good at what we do. Trust me, we are good at what we do. Uh, whether it's, you know, any one of my handful of team, we love to help you. We know these sales agents. So get us involved early on. Do not call the sales agents. Do not call Terry or Joyce and say, hey, no, you want to call me and let me get you to one of my agents so that we can be in on the program with you. But that's how it works. If you've been talking to them for three months, they may or may not want to, to allow us to represent you at their expense. But if you call us early on, and it may be in this neighborhood, it may be some other neighborhood. So you have the benefit of a buyer agent. Because if you walk in to that model home, uh, they are fully represented and you are not represented at all. Call me and let me explain that to you. 704-345-3400. If I've helped you today, I think I have. Uh, hit that subscribe button, like it, and better yet, couple that with a phone call to 704-345-3400. And I can't wait to talk to you soon. And I'll also see you in the next video.